morning welcome back to the glass menagerie today we're going to talk a little bit about etched and sandblasted glass here is a entrance prepped for sandblasting the green is a sandblast stencil the full-scale artwork has been prepared in advance and then transferred onto the green stencil it is then with exacto knives we cut everything out we pre-cut everything before the sandblasting process begins so this is the glass prepped with the design. Sandblasting is a process of shooting sand on the glass where we start carving and etching the glass. The sand removes the glass that's there and we do it in layers. Now we're in the sandblast room. Here is a piece being sandblasted. This is as far as I have got with the piece. The green resist is removed in layers and that's where I go my deepest to my shallowest. The sand is aluminum oxide, 120 grit, it's very fine, it's as fine as flour. That's what we shoot at the sand, that's what I cut the glass with. You can see the different layers. So the stencil is removed. So this would be my next spot to sandblast. So I peel the stencil up. This is my deepest carve or sandblast area here. Then I will go here, here, and I work it in levels or stages. These are two of the pieces that are completed, one door, one side light. So the next stage now is we start applying all the bevel pieces that will be laminated onto the piece once I take the green stencil off. So these are pieces that are completed the sandblasting stage. So we've reached the end stages now where we put the finishing touches on the piece. I've laid the bevels out. Each, all four panels get a layout of bevels like this. They have to be ground and fit. So this is the section that's laid out. You can take a look. If you come in closer, you can see how the bevels accent the piece and really finish it off. So I will get one piece applied so you can see. And then the installation is after that, and that will be the finishing or the end of the project. Thank you. So this is the finished side, and this is what the customers and their friends would see as they come towards the house. This would be the outside and the finished side of the glass. Which you will see on the final of the video on the installation. Unfortunately, the decorators did not allow us to come back and film the installation of this project. So all we have for you is my wonderful voice and photographs. So you can see by the photographs, the entrance has been installed. You can see how the light refracts off of the bevels and how it adds a beautiful finishing touch to the piece. I hope you enjoyed as much as we enjoyed making it. Thank you until we meet again. Visit us at glassmenagerie.net or write to us on Facebook and follow us. Thank you and have a nice day.